Interesting. Oh my goodness. Jesus Christ. Let him live. He's just a boy. What's poppin', folks? Welcome to another Disney Opera Omnia tier list. We are doing BT animations. And we're doing every single one up to JP. Yes, that includes the new ones. I'm very excited. So let's just go ahead and get started. Number one, we have Warrior of Light. We're gonna need to double check how that looks. The quality's very shitty, forgive me. Yeah, he just spins a shield around Beyblade style. I mean, it's not like anything too crazy, but it's cool. It's it's cool. And the theme is pretty nifty too, so I guess I'll I'll put him in B tier for now. Alright, next you have Vivi. You gotta check this out. And then he turns that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't even know what form that is, because I've never played Final Fantasy IX, but it looks pretty freaking sick, and you got all that fire explosion. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I wish it was uh, AOE instead of single target, but that was pretty freaking cool regardless. Love the theme. Vivi's very adorable, and I like the new form. I'm going to give this A tier. Tifa! I like the excessive amount of attacks and HP dumps. It's very pleasing to the eye. Yeah, this is a solid animation. I'll give this A tier. Cloud next. I mean, this is just a classic, you guys. He's got him floating up in the air with the blue sword. You got, a, like, the freaking Noctis thing going on here. And you got hella damage here, too. It, everything here is just iconic. I mean, what am I supposed to say about it? It's just classic Final Fantasy. I, put, I gotta put an S tier. All right, Ishtola. This gotta be, like, one of the best. BT animations of all time, right? Because she got uh, all that extra freaking My Sims crystals going around her. You got the you got the typical magic staff twirl. You got the I don't even know what that is. Is that like a giant mirror? I don't even know what the hell was happening right there, but that was freaking sick. And I love the theme too, so I gotta put her in S tier. All right, now with Sedan. Okay, here we go. And you got the transformation as well. For me, whenever there's a transformation in any BT animation, it immediately levels it up one tier. And I don't even know what he shot. Did he shoot, like, mini lasers? Apart from the transformation, which was really cool, none of the other stuff really wowed me. So I guess even though there is a transformation, I'm gonna have to put my boy at C tier. We have Diesel, Dark Cecil. Okay. They talking? All right, enough talking. Can we get to the animation, please? All right. Oh, hello. Wings? Oh. Wait. Oh. Oh. Tag team? Okay. I mean, I was I was expecting more, to be honest. I wanted there to be more. It felt like the theme is kind of cool, but I feel like there should be more than one flashy attack for me to tier a BT animation highly. Yeah, nothing was interesting there besides that one attack at the end. I'm going to put this at C tier. Vaughn next. Brings out the four orbs. Got a nice little diamond shape there. And you got a huge spirit bomb there and throw it at him. Yeet. Simple, sweet to the point. It does the job. It was decent. It wasn't bad at all. And the theme also hits for me. I'm gonna put him at A tier above Tifa. Yuna next. I don't even gotta check. Everyone knows how good Yuna's BT looks. I mean, come on now. The theme is amazing. She freaking... Turns a fountain below her, got a freaking laser, fireballs, electricity, all the elements. She got all the four elements. I don't even know what the hell that is. That's like a astronomy beam. Okay. I think this is still the strongest BT finisher in the entire game. So, um, yeah, checks all the boxes for me. S tier. Barts. Right, got the animation, this theme. Uh, I've heard this theme so many times because I've used Bart's a lot when his original green came out. Uh, quite frankly, I've overplayed it and I'm kind of sick of the song, but this animation is still pretty cool regardless. I like the versatility of the weapons. I like that the weapons merged with him and then he used every single one of them to attack the enemy. That was pretty freaking cool. It's not one of my favorites, but it definitely is one of the more creative ones in the game. I'll put him at A tier. Terra's next. I mean, the theme is just classic. You have to set the option to where the BT theme finishes the entire fight if you use Terra. I feel like that's just giving its due respect. The attack for the most part is, I don't know, relatively simple. So I'm gonna put this at a B tier. Onion Knight is next. Actually, now that I think about it, I don't think I've ever seen Onion Knight's animation. This, okay. Okay, you got a little staff there. Oh, oh, Harry Potter? Fire and Ice? Okay. 
little spell right there. Okay, what is he doing? Oh, it's the meteor? What in the world? Okay, that was freaking sick, yo. <laughs> that was sick. And I love the 8-bit music, too. That's always a beautiful touch. And wait, you have two? Wait, you, wait. Wait, why are there two? Wait, 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 what? Why is there two? And, okay, swords. Okay. Turn into a ninja. What are you doing? What the hell? Okay. Did the freaking anime fly through the enemy and then do the sword attacks? That was freaking sick! Yo, that's gotta be the best I've seen today. Okay, all right, on your night, I'll give you a little S tier for that. All right, Furion. Pfft. I ain't even gotta look at the animation to tier Furion, but I'm gonna just do it for you guys. Oh, that theme is... I Honestly, it's probably my favorite theme in the entire video game. Uh, boom, boom, boom. Got flying around. Ooh, arrows. Fire. It's just so cool. The voice actor is so cool. The theme is so amazing. This is gonna be a completely biased placement, but f it, bro. I don't give a f This is my channel, all right? S tier. Okay, Laguna next. Okay, here we go. Boom. Get that golden gun there. I don't know what the hell. I, where, do you, where do you even get that? But it's just there. Freaking Gundam head ass and shoot him with laser it's nice and simple the theme slaps and uh yeah it's pretty good overall i'll put laguna a tier right here now we have his son mm. theme slaps like the thing Ooh, aoe we always love that and you got a freaking it's not as amazing as his uh limit burst animation from brave xv Lord have mercy, I'm about to bust. To be honest, I wish the sword grew to a bigger size than just, you know, twice of Squall, but I guess I can't really ask too much from a free game. I'll put Squall here in B tier. Shantoto next. It's been a very long while since I've seen Shantoto's BT animation. Okay, all right. Okay, the little ice attacks, nice. Single target. Oh, flying staff. Um. Okay, it was not horrible. I would have wished for her to do a little bit more. I wish she did the same thing as Brave Exvius, where she freaking got a moon and did bowling with it. That would have been sick. I'm about to bust. All right, I edited this a little bit. Balthier, he just came out on JP. So for some of you guys, this might be the first time you're ever seeing this. The theme is great. Like that? Mm -hmm. oh, Bermuda Triangle? What? Shadow Clone Jutsu? What, do you, what the meteor? What the hell? Oh, sh I mean, that should have done way more damage in my opinion, but the animation was sick, bro. This dude freaking summoned a meteor from heaven. Okay, Balthy, I see you. I'm gonna have to put you right here, boy. Okay, Titus next. Oh, yeah, the Titus. I mean, nothing really crazy here happens. It's just him slicing him with a blade. Doing a jump on it, getting a volley from Yuna, and then kicking it. It's cool, but like I said before with some other ones, his Brave XVS animation was a lot better. I wish the enemy was flying on top of a mountain, and then Titus kicked the ball right into the guy into the mountain. It's not that impressive to me. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to put his D tier. Prish next. Some of you guys might have forgotten that she did have a BT. Yes, yeah, she does have a BT. I know. I know. It's hard to remember sometimes, but uh. Boom, 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 boom. Close combat. Quarters. Okay. Got a, what, what she got? Got a, a pin? Throw a pin at me? What the? Okay. Okay. That turned into a light crystal, and then that light crystal exploded. Okay, that was kind of like some Devil May Cry shit right there. I'm gonna put her in a respectable C tier right here. Ramza! Oh, come on, bro. Y'all already know. That's my boy, bro. Got the amazing theme. One of the best themes in the city of Opera Omnia, in my opinion. Don't at me. You got that little that thing right there, but boom. Got the Hammer of Dawn from Invincible there. I love the theme. I love the premise. I like the little text box that they put at the top. It just the attack itself, I wish he did more. So I'm gonna put that at B tier. Okay, Lael is next. Uh, the theme is great. Theme is great. Okay, got Silver Surfer out here. Okay, boom. Throw that. 
And you're gonna surf through. Wahoo! I mean, it was cool, and the theme is nice, but literally nothing happened. He just threw a ball at it. Nothing super creative was going on there. I'll be completely honest with you guys. So, yeah, I'm gonna have to put him at D tier. Time for Vincent. Mister Oh, his voice broke. Mister Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Say Ikazu, bro. You got the transformation, bro. That's gotta be like the coolest transformation ever in this game. I feel like I have to give him S tier just because of that. You win, bro. <laughs> Time for Ace. Got a little flag right there. Yeah, plant it. Neil Armstrong style. And got a little. I don't know what the hell this is. Are those birds? I can't really tell. I know there's a phoenix there that comes out there. It's cool. I like the premise of it. I just wish it was more visually executed. Uh, B tier right here. Seymour is next. Oh, some people are not gonna like how I tier Seymour, but it is what it is, guys. You can't please everyone. Bro, you can't lie that the theme is actually kind of sick. I don't know if you... He got a little anchor. Okay, yeah. Overdrive. Bro, this is sick, dog. That was sick. This dude brought up Davy Jones' locker from hell and then had him attack for him. That was pretty... That That's pretty gangster. I wish we saw a bit more of the zombies attacking the actual enemies rather than just seeing a POV. Regardless, it was really cool. I think I'm gonna have to put him top eight tier. That was really good. Okay, time for snow. Definitely need a refresher with this too. Got a little ice staff. Nice. And I remember he does like a freaking ice hurricane here. I mean, it kind of just looks like an embelly. I mean, it kind of just looks like a slightly flashier version of his LD attack. I mean, yeah, it looks kind of cool, but come on, bro. Could you do something a little bit more different than that? I'll put him at low B tier. Lightning is next. He's got little hook blades there. That has no actual practicality to them, I have to admit. Got a little thunder. Nice thunder. Yeah. I wish it did more damage, to be honest, but... Again, you can't really please everyone. The theme is sick, but I don't like the fact that it was single target. I'll put lightning B tier right here. Time for Ash. Somewhat recent BT that came out on JP, but it's been a while since I've seen the animation, so I will need to see that again. Cards, nice. Floating cards, okay, magician. Okay, is she gonna give me a tarot card, bro? What's going on here? Okay, you just threw a card at, that was it? You just threw a card at him, that was it. And it's only six turns too? Oh, hell no, nah, bro. You're not gonna give me a mid animation like that and have the BT effect only still be six turns? Nah, you gotta get out, bro. <laughs> okay, time for Aerith. Everyone's been so hype about Aerith's BT, me included. I love using it, but just for the sake of showing you guys how it looks. I freaking hated this boss, by the way. This boss was complete AIDS. I would never do this fight again. The theme is also very relaxing, very nice. It's nice. Got a little, uh, water, which did no damage, but okay. Got a little life aura there. It's cool. It's not as dynamic or as crazy as, say, Balthier's BT animation, but it does the job, and it does a lot more damage than Balthier, that's for sure. So it evens out relatively, I suppose. I'm gonna put her here. Okay, time for Garnet. Oh man, everyone was up in arms when her PT came out in global. I've overplayed the theme way too much. Now I'm kind of sick of it. But the animation is still really cool. And they're praying. Okay, yeah, praise be to this castle thing. I still haven't played Final Fantasy IX, so I have no idea what that is, but it looks cool. I think it's Alexander. Yeah, Alexander. Yeah, she prayed to Alexander with wings, and then, yeah, boom, there you go. Yeah, that was like some Disney shit, bro. <laughs> Freaking summon Mickey's castle to attack the enemy. It's cool, and I'm sure it's very nostalgic for people who have played Final Fantasy IX and love Garnet from Final Fantasy IX. But personally, for me, who's never played it, I don't have that big of a connection. I might piss some people off when I put this, but um, yeah, I'm gonna put her right here. Time for Sarah, which is another BT that recently came out on JP. I actually have her BT. I actually have her entire kit built in JP, and let me tell you guys, I love using her. I think she's absolutely amazing. I love the theme, and I love the fact that Lightning is with her in that costume, too. So it's it's extra sick. 
I wish they kind of just reused this animation for Lightning's BT as well. <laughs> just got rid of her own animation. Just two of the same animation because, in my opinion, it's just way better. And I love the follow-up, too, that she does whenever she doesn't attack. Or should I say, the follow-up that her sister does whenever she doesn't attack. I'm gonna put her right here. Time for Celeste. Don't think I've actually ever seen Celeste's BT animation. So this is gonna be a first for me. Okay. Oh, 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 laser. Wh who's talking? Oh my Jesus. Okay, lock. All right, that was sick. Even though lock did most of the work. <laughs> I like when they do like multiple elements, like when they do ice attack and then a fire attack and then a water attack. Just because of that, she's at least going in eight tier. I'll put her right here. Time for Kane. Oh buddy. I have mixed feelings about Kane. His BT theme is really freaking good. But his animation, he jumps from a rock and then does a, some spear attacks. Yeah, that's it. It's, yeah, that attack was pretty underwhelming. I'm going to have to put it C tier. Time for Kuja next. I don't think I've actually ever seen Kuja's BT animation. This is going to be fun. Now that I think about it, there's a lot of animations that I haven't seen. Let me see his attack animation. Okay, yeah, he transformed like he did in Terra's FR. That's cool. Oh, orbs. Oh! Explosion! Oh, now that was... Oh, there's a lot of explosions and orbs flying everywhere. That was sick. Okay, Kuja. I'm impressed. Yeah, that's got to be S tier. That's got to be like up here, bro. That was... Whoo, time for Kefka. All right. Okay. A little shine a light. Shine a light on me. Ooh, oh, oh, what is this? What is that? What was that Persona animation right there? What did he throw? That was like a thunderball. Nice. That was very unique. Wow. Yeah, I'll put that S here, man. That was freaking good. Okay, time for Sephiroth. Oh, man, I love the theme. You got the got the wing. Ooh. That's it. Come on, bro. That was so underwhelming. For it, a theme like this, you should have way flashier of an attack. Yeah, that was very disappointing. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sephiroth. That's gotta be D tier, bro. I love your theme, but pff, that animation was not it. Okay, time for Ject. This takes me back. I remember using Ject almost all the time. He needs an FR soon, bro. He needs one. It's time. <laughs> With that great guitar music in the background, yeah. Got freaking kicked a meteor into pieces and kicked that into him. That's freaking sick, man. That's what I'm freaking talking about, bro. Easy S tier. Get that up there. Time for Yuri. I don't actually think I've seen Yuri's. Maybe if I did, I completely forgot how it looked. Oh. Bro, I love when they put circles on the ground. It just makes it so much cooler. Oh, what? What? Why are there four? Were there four Yuri's there? What the hell happened? I, I was just... Confused by that. I mean, the fact that the sister did nothing in the entire animation is kind of disappointing. But I wish we saw more of Yuri. I wish we saw multiple Yuri's just attack him at the same time. That would have been really sick. Uh, yeah, not that impressive to me. I'll probably have to put it C tier. All right, time for Zack. Oh, buddy. I don't even need to look at his stuff, bro. I don't even need to look at his stuff, bro. S tier. Come on now. Noctis. Oh, man. I wish I could use Noctis viably again. Got little swords there. Boom. Boom. I mean, it does a lot of damage, single target. The, I like the whole teleportation flying swords thing. That part was always really cool to me for Noctis. Nothing there was jaw-dropping, but just the amazing theme overall. And yeah, the flying swords and teleportation thing, man, it just, it still made it a pretty enjoyable experience. So I guess I will put him A tier right here. All right, Gildamesh next. Oh, buddy. <laughs> the theme is really nice. And shout outs to him having Zoro's voice actor. I like the fact that he has different swords. I mean, I don't really like him, but that was a pretty solid animation. I'll put him at A tier right here. Lock. Woo -hoo -hoo. That takes me back, man. I remember using lock almost every mission. Okay, he brings out a crystal. I don't even know what that crystal is, to be honest. And that turns into three dots and it turns into a phoenix. It makes no sense to me, but the animation is sick. Yeah, it's a pretty solid BT attack. I will put him right here. Time for Paladin Cecil. I remember Paladin Cecil being my very first BT that I ever got in the city of Opera Omnia Global. 
Alright, he powers up his sword and he flies. He does a little twirl. That was kind of cool. And he switches forms. I think that's a nice dynamic right there. That was solid. Not one of the best I've seen, but I'm not mad at it. I'll put him right here. All right, time for his brother, Golbez. And let's see how this animation looks. Oh, got drag. Ooh, got the dragon doing attacks. Thunder. Ooh, orbs. That's sick. Okay, I like that. Yeah, I like it definitely better than Cecil. That was the first time I've seen that too. It's decent. I feel like with that type of attack, there could have been a lot more stuff that have happened. But from what I saw so far, it wasn't the worst thing in the world. I'll put that here. Top B tier. Renoa. Oh, she bring a dog in there? Oh, this might be S tier. <laughs> this might be an S tier. Oh, dog. Okay, dog doing in work. Got a little Frieza laser. Oh, this... I like the dog in there, so automatically she gets a tier higher. So overall, low A tier for me. Lawn and Rain. I really like Lawn and Rain's attack. And he got freaking powered up this dog. I don't know what the hell that is. But it put in work with the swords. I don't know what that is either. People who've played World of Final Fantasy, let me know what the hell that is. Because I don't know what it is. But it looks sick. It's a very fun animation. I think I'll have to put her below Seymour. Vayne is next. What? Have I seen Vayne? Powering up, got the electricity. Oh, he's doing a Eustace kid from One Piece. Freaking made a sword out of metal. That, oh. I feel like that's just a better squall attack. Yeah, I like that. Okay, I'll have to put him right here. Ooh, Pain is next. Can't wait to see hers. Hers just came out too, so that's gonna be fun. Okay, King Arthur. Breaking the glass. All right, ooh, guns. Oh, that was clean. I like the amount of weapons that she used in her attack. I will put her right there. Okay, time for Noel. I don't like the fact that it's only single target again. Yeah, he's not too big of a fan, to be honest. Probably C tier for me. Sherlotta. I love the music, too, that comes. It's definitely one of my favorite themes in the game. Crack the crystal. Explode. I really like the theme, but the animation itself is pretty mid. Shalada, I'm sorry I gotta do this to you, but uh... Time for Garland! Garland is next. This music is very nostalgic to me. Love the weapons. Red Tornado? Hell yes. That was... Whew, love the fire. Love the color. It would have been really cool if they still had that red aura around his weapons when his BT effect was active. I mean, of course, that would take a lot more work, but it would have been really cool. Yeah, it's a pretty solid A tier for me. Ooh, Ultimecia. This might be the best. Flying... Ooh. <laughs> Flying X, Dio, Brando, the world. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, buddy boy. The time stopping thing is such a cool idea. I wish they implemented that technique more into people's BT attacks, just changing the timing of the music. More people should be able to do that. I will put her right there. It's really freaking good. Time for Machina. I really enjoy using Machina as a unit, but in terms of BT animation, yeah. I have to admit, I've seen better. <laughs> Got the spotlight on him. I like the dive. I wish there was more. That's just a recurring theme with a lot of these BT animations. Like, they have good ideas, but I wish they were embellished on more. I wish there was some way that they could edit BT animations, added stuff with the animations themselves. I think that would be a really cool idea. But I understand it's going to take a lot more work, so I don't exactly blame them for not doing so. I will put him right there. Emperor! Oh, man, I remember Emperor was so cool. <laughs> Oh, man. Woohoo! The orbs, man. The orbs always get me in the circle on the ground. Yes, sir. Exploding orbs, bro. What more can you ask for? Yeah, that's definitely S tier material. Above Kuja and Furion. Sorry, Furion. Time for Camel Not Next. Oh, man. I really like the theme, and I like the idea of him cloning himself. But, oh my goodness, the execution could have been way better. Yeah. That's it. That's the entire animation. Nothing else happened. It was just 
Three attacks. Yeah. I'm not impressed either. It's painful when I do this, but come on, Cam. You can do better. Kiaren. Ooh, Kiaren was so cool, man. He's someone who I originally wanted to green, but I never ended up doing so because I greened Laguna instead. But I can't deny that his theme and the animation of his attacks, I like the use of the orbs exploding into different elements and that finishing attack at the end. Ooh, it's a nice touch. It's definitely high A tier for me personally. Caius, Caius next. What, is, what did Caius look like? Turn into the red eyes. Okay, shotting gun. Ooh, transformation. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh, shoot. That is so cool. That's S tier, if anything. I'll put him right here. X death is next. I like the sound effects. He's going to compress them into a black hole, right? I like the idea. The creativity with that one was nice. That was real juicy right there, guys. I can't lie. I'll put him right below here. Time for Cloud of Darkness. You can't... What I like about Cloud of Darkness's attacks is that they're all orbs and lasers. Two of my favorite forms of attack in fiction. Right above X Death. Yield Narch is next. I don't think I've actually ever seen Yield Narch's BT attack. And if I did, I completely forgot about it. Let's see how this looks. Oh, sword. Ooh. 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 Oh, oh, I like the teleportation. Okay. Ooh. This is looking real juicy, guys. That, okay. If anything, it's definitely better than his brother. <laughs> He's definitely way better than Cam's. The teleportation for me really was what sold the deal. I'm gonna put him above Noctis at the very least. Gabranth. Turn into a sword. Multiple slashes. Decent. Ooh, what is he doing? He's prepping an attack? Okay. Ooh, that's a nice idea. That's a nice idea. I like the stop in the middle of the sword attack just to emphasize that he's doing multiple attacks with the sword. Yeah, to me, that last part of the attack was just a better version of Squall. And there was more to that attack, not just the sword thing. Yeah, he definitely has grounds to be an A tier. I thought that was really good. Arden. Ooh, roses. Ooh, I very much like that. Yes, sir. Oh, uh, this is way better than Noctis's. <laughs> Wait a minute, that's it? What? That was it? Oh, come on. I thought he was just starting up the attack. I didn't know that was the entire thing. The beginning portion was very beautiful, but at the end, come on, bro. You could have done way more than that. Ah, uh, what a letdown. What a letdown. Honestly, guys, I'll have to put him in C tier. I was hoping for so much more. Kurasame is next. Get that. Oh, that's a beautiful looking sword. Ice? 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 Also, he's basically just freezing them so he can cut them in half. That's a really nice idea. I like that. Yeah. And I love the amount of freeze that there was in the animation. Uh, I'll put him right here. Okay, Seador is next. What did Seador's look like? Oh, this theme? Very nice. And he got his dad. Let's go. Oh, shoot. I love the flashiness. Turn into orbs. Oh, 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 oh. That was so clean. Oh my God, that was way better than any of his dad's attacks. Oh, the son has surpassed the father. That's for sure. That is a very, very clear S tier. Where am I gonna put this bad boy? Uh, I'll put him right here. It's very, actually, no, let me move Zach down because <laughs> my bias is showing. All right, Mog, woo, hoo, 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 Mog, 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 Mog. Oh, he's bowing? Oh my God, what is he throwing at him? Oh. Is he? <laughs> oh my god, why didn't I get his BT, man? I'm so upset. I'll put him in A tier because that was fun, but to be honest, I was expecting more. Iroha is next. I am considering getting her BT whenever it drops on global. Oh, laser. Oh, 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 shoot. Okay, team up. Woo, got the wings. Snap. Oh, oh, cross. Yo, that's sick. That was stunning. <laughs> oh my goodness, man. That's what the hell I'm talking about. Yeah, I'll put her up there, man. Oh, that was some beautiful stuff. Next, we have Sid Reigns. Okay, wind attacks. Oh, got the wings out. Bro, damn, bro, how many wings do you need? That's it? 
Just a little Hadouken? That's all you got, bro? I guess they spent all the animation budget for his follow-up. <laughs> I wish there was a bit more to his animation. I gotta put him at D tier, bro. That was heart-wrenching to watch. Next up, we have the best BT in the game. <laughs> Jacob. Oh, he dropped his arm. Red arm? Nice. Okay. Oh, crystallize himself. Interesting. Oh my goodness. Jesus Christ. Let him live. He's just a boy. That, yeah, that's S tier material, bro. That was pretty nasty, bro. I'm gonna have to put him right here. Yo, we got all the hitters with the last five. Hello. Starting off with Luna Freya. She floats down like a goddess. Thunder. Thunder. Bro, that is crazy. Freaking tsunami. Crystal wall and a laser with the flower petals at the end. Just got everything you need for a BT attack. Again, I like the different amount of elements incorporated into the attack. I like the fact that there isn't just two HP dumps. It's always extra bonus points from me. It's AoE. So what what can you dislike about it? It's definitely way better than Noctis's, that's for sure. But is it S tier? <sighs> Maybe not. I will put her at top of A tier for now. You know, it's not A tier. Jack Garland right here. Let's look him up real quick. Okay, his theme is the best in the game. That's like undeniable. Undeniable. It is the best. It's the reason why I use it in so many of my videos. And boom, boom, thunder, crystal, literally everything, bro. Hit him with a tsunami, might as well. I feel like I have to, man. <laughs> I feel like I feel like there's no other place to put him. Time for Neon, his best friend, who I have, by the way, and I love using her. Fire sword. Slice. Little Hadouken. Boo. Thunder. Not thunder. Fire. Yeah, it's it's a lot simpler than Jack Garland's and it's not as flashy as his, but I like the amount of fire that she included in it. On top of that, her theme is fun. A solid A tier for me. Now we're down to our last two JP units that aren't yet on global and will not be for a very long while. We have Rubicante and Kina. I have Rubicante, I do not have Kina. I kind of regret not getting her, to be honest. Boy, this guy is so much fun to play. So much fun to play. Got skulls, water. You got thunder, you got dark, you got fire, you got, he's doing all the Pokemon types, which kind of makes no sense because his entire thing is fire attacks, but uh, <laughs> it still looks really cool regardless. Top of A tier for me personally. And the transformation? Okay, cooking. Yo, Ignis, where you at, bro? You got competition. Oh my goodness. Yikes. <laughs> Turn him into cake and eat him. Okay, Majin Buu, I see you. I mean, it's funny, but I'm not, like, floored by it. <laughs> it's definitely the most unique attack out of everyone here. So I'll put her right here at A tier. Okay, guys, so that's going to be the definitive BT unit tier list for all of the BT units up to current JP. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you agree, disagree with anyone in this channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!